Welcome to Tech Resolve Dame. In this video, we are going to learn about lookup operator in Kusto. The lookup operator extends the columns of a fact table with the values looked up in the dimension table. So lookup operator pretty much work uh, with the same like uh, with the join types. So let's go ahead and take a look how it works. Now there are some uh, limitations and uh, we have to understand that. So let me take you there and show you here. So this is a Microsoft document you can read through. I will put the link in the description. So when you're going to use a lookup table, so you have fact table first. So that means your left table is a fact table. Then you're going to say lookup kind outer join or left order. So that's by default, if you don't put anything, that's gonna be left outer. That means that show me everything from the left table, that means from the fact table, and uh, uh, even those records matching on the right side or not. So you're gonna get everything from the left side, uh, and then also get the matching records uh, from the dimension table. Uh, so that's what you're gonna do. And then you're gonna say on common column, if it is the same column name, you don't uh, just put the column name otherwise uh, you can say left dot column one and the uh, right dot column two or three whatever the name of those uh, columns so these are your gonna joining condition uh. now here uh, are some uh, the results uh, does not repeat column from the right table if they uh, that are basis for the join operation uh, only two kinds of lookup are supported left outer and inner and uh, without uh, left outer being in the default uh, so left outer is by default and uh, you have another option is the inner. So you can pretty much read the whole thing, you, you know, there, there are other uh, kind of uh, uh, more information uh, provided here. You can take a look on that one. Now let's go to the demo here and perform that. So think about that the customer table is my fact table that has customer ID and name. In fact table mostly we don't have names, so we have only IDs. But anyways, I just created customer table and um, for example, so you have this uh, for uh, as a fact table, then you have a uh, order, order table as uh, your dimension. So that's uh, what's happening in customer ID in both tables. Uh, that's the exactly same name. So there is one matching col column name. Now, what I will do if I would like to do something like the, uh, use the lookup. So I will say customer table, lookup, order table, and then uh, I just simply, if I even, uh, let me copy this. If as if my column name is exactly matching, I don't even have to say left dot column dot right and all. So I can simply say that on a customer ID, that's all. Because the same column name exists in both tables and that's what I would like to use for the joining. So I can execute this. Now you see here what it is doing. It is returning me all the records from the left tables. That's our a customer table so it has a steve id3 customer id that does not exist in our order table so you can see right there there is no customer id with the four so we have only one two and uh, sorry we have only one two and four there is no customer id three here so that's why we are getting everything from our left table that's our customer table and also getting the matching records from the right side that's our order table now uh, if you have a different column names then you can write something like this so you will say customer look up your uh, uh, dimension table on and then you will say left that means your customer table here and then the name of the column on which you would like to join or equal to equal to right that's your uh, second call, uh, table here that will be your dimension table and then you will say the name of that uh, column on which uh, you would like to join uh, with the left uh, table uh, and then you will execute uh, so this is the uh, exactly same uh, query results that we saw for the previous one because our column name is matching in both uh, tables now if you want to just specify it uh, kind of a uh, join you can do that as well so you will say customer lookup kind of left outer and then uh, your dimension and then uh, on list of the columns on you which you like to join. So as I said that the left outer is default and if you don't provide it here this is exactly the same results you are going to get. So you see that you are getting everything from the left table and also matching records from the right side. Now there is another option you have available for you in the lookup that's the inner. So go ahead and execute. Now it's going to give us all the matching records only. So that's what the 
uh, inner join is uh, going to do here with the lookup. So if you are using lookup with the inner, then it means only matching records from both tables. That's what you are going to get. So uh, I don't know. Uh, honestly, I have not used. Uh, I didn't have fact table like with millions of rows and joining with the dimension. And uh, then I use lookup or uh, joins. Um, so that's why I can't really tell you if this is a performance, you know, improvements with by using lookup or something like that. But uh, it uh, works pretty much same like uh, join. So you have left outer and the inner join. That's what it is. But you're using a, as a lookup operator. So experiment it if you have uh, your uh, dimension table, fact table, and all that. Uh, use uh, uh, the join uh, that I showed you in the previous videos, like this kind of, uh, where, where you're just uh, going to join the data instead of using lookup operator. And see the comparison. If lookup is uh, designed in a way like it give you faster results from the fact table, or join works the same way. So I would love to learn about that. Thank you very much for watching. Please subscribe my channel, and I will see you guys in the next video.